drive along this stretch of Highway 276, Gear Highway in Marietta, and there's a good chance you would have seen 68-year-old William Pruitt walking on the sidewalk. He never had his license, actually. He walked, he's walked these streets for probably, he's 60, probably about 45 to 50 years. Pruitt retired after a long career at Slater Mill. His nephew, Ethan Green, lived with him in Marietta. He was very christian person so you know he just went with the flow god has a plan for everybody and he stuck to that and he would spread that message a lot he was always kind and you know same to you and stuff like that because it, a, it could have been the last time you ever see somebody again saturday night would be the last time this community saw him highway patrol said pruitt died around 8 30 after suburban hit him while he was crossing the highway. He would generally come walking through here once a day. Lawrence Ledford is a business owner along Gear Highway. He says the road is dangerous and wants to see more street lighting and a traffic light near where Pruitt was hit. We could put a red light at this intersection, which has 20 cars a minute go through this intersection. And the cars that are just passing here now are going over 35 miles an hour. That's what the speed limit is. They should probably add more crosswalks through here, especially with people walking. I mean, there's a couple, there's a couple people that I know in Marietta that walk everywhere they go. They don't have a vehicle. Green says his family has been touched by the support from this community. A lot of people cared about him. That, you know, touches our hearts because he was a great man. He's probably one of the best men that I've ever known. In Marietta, Taggart Houck, WYFF News 4.